Yeah. We are Insights of the She Shed. I'm Julie Hassowitz, Remax Suburban. I'm Jeannie Gorey, Neighborhood Loans, Money in the Middle. Jamie Zafransky, Remax Suburban. So today we are doing some fun holiday cocktails and a couple cute appetizers. And, and qu quick and easy. Quick and maybe, easy. Maybe not Jeannie's cocktails. But oh yeah, they are. They're quick and easy. But, but cocktails are worth it. They are worth it. Totally so, worth the time. You know, there's a lot of fun cocktails out this season, but this is one that I thought was kind of fun. It's a little drippy here because we're in the little heat You want to here. walk it up while you but talk? It, but anyway, so what it is, is it's a glass with whipped cream around the top with crushed peppermint. On the inside, it's two thirds of rum chata and one third of fireball. <gasps> oh, and there's a little, and wow. a little cinnamon, cinnamon stick, stick wow, inside. Wow, that is... So that is That's quick, a small glass. quick and easy to make. <laughs> Just make sure you refrigerate the whipped cream so it doesn't yes. melt. Yeah. Maybe yeah, you can refrigerate the glasses after you put them on. What okay, that's that's yummy. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. yummy. Okay, the drink? next no. one is um, I've never had Fireball. Drink. I've never had Fireball, really? and that yeah, that's yummy oh, with ranchata. Oh, it's so good. Yummy you can, with ranchata. You can get away. I mean, Fireball Fiery personality. Will get you fast. Yeah. Okay, so this is kind of a take on the Bailey's and Irish, you know, coffee kind of a thing. So mm -hmm. there's coffee in here. There's Bailey's uh, cream. There is butterscotch schnapps, Ooh, and it's called hot damn cinnamon <laughs> schnapps. So that's what it's called. I'm not swearing. That's what it's called. And a little whipped cream on the top. It's yep. really good. That would be it's fun at twist. like your morning holiday brunch, too. Right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yes. So am I, you're going to taste it. You're again? the taste yes, tester. Yes, she's the taster again. Napkins. And look at these cute little holiday napkins. Don't forget them. Like you know, you can get ones that say really nice things. You can get say things that say kind of funny things. You know, whatever your you know, cater to your crowd. What okay, do you think? again, so, can I just say, mm -mm. <laughs> yummers, <laughs> yummers, can yummers. I say yummers, yummers. Okay, my turn. Okay, so, let me step mine this aside. Is super, super easy. It's actually a chin. recipe Here. from um, the Barefoot Contessa, who I love. Um, oh, she's so, great. Yeah, yeah, super easy. Easy Slice and quick. Right? Easy and quick. quick. Sliced. Um, I use a baguette. I think it's easier. Yep. A camembert cheese or like a brie, something like that. And then prosciutto, you put them on just like this. Maybe a little bit um, of thyme okay. on it, sprinkle it on. I like the thyme. Yep, the fr yep. The fresh the herbs, fresh yep. people. And then you broil Lovely. it. Just watch it, make sure it doesn't um, burn. Oh, and I put, yeah, it doesn't burn. And I put a little bit of olive oil on the bread because I think it, you know. And Makes you're done. Toasting. And and the nice, nice thing is, so you, you can don't actually pre, you don't pre toast nope, the bread. Nope. And just, the thing is, is, you can oh. actually assemble them like ahead of time. I had something this weekend. I had them all out. I had them on a sheet pan, and literally, as people came, I popped them in, and they were done. Oh, so awesome. Awesome. Super fast. And they that look is. like they would hold up. Like they're yeah, not going to yeah. get. Um, yeah. That's you know how fantastic. sometimes you put like the cheese oh, tray out, and the one. cheeses start to sweat. Mm -hmm. This one. one that looks delightful. Here, you want the other end of mine? No, I, <laughs> I will don't try yours COVID. later because oh, we got to whip mine out and, yeah. and whip it into gear. Okay, this is mine really is really good. Uh -huh. Super easy. Okay, so mine is super easy too. Ooh, I'm, I'm just going to mm, step Ooh. into the side just to show you all the bits. All the bits and bits. Yeah, I love I love the cocktail napkins, oh. by the way. I mean, that really festives it up. Yeah, look at this one. It's a little dark napkin, so which super, is kind of unusual. I've never mm -hmm. seen. Yeah, I've mm -hmm. never seen with a black background. Mm -hmm. So super simple. Um, this is actually cream cheese. So instead of sticking out the brick of cream cheese, I usually cut it in half and I kind of form an oval or a ball. I've seen people mm -hmm. cut it into the shape of a Christmas tree if oh, you're yeah? celebrating wow. Christmas, oh, yeah, which is really my cool. holiday. Snowball. So you do that, you <laughs> take maybe, head. again with the herbs, you do a little basil or something to the side on the plate, and then you take those cranberries that nobody ate. Thanksgiving, <laughs> they're still in the I fridge. I eat them. I love them. I, I do too. Them. I mm -hmm. am a cranberry girl. Mm -hmm. So I make homemade cranberries. So you take your cranberries, you take some, you throw it into a pan with a little chopped jalapeno. Oh, nice. And then you make your own pepper jelly. <gasps> but it's a cranberry pepper jelly. Oh, and it's nice. homemade. So it's homemade so you can make it as sweet as you want, as spicy as you want. And it lasts for a long time. It does. Yeah. I mean, it aside does. from the fact everybody wants to eat it, I yeah. mean, before they no, eat it, it lasts like, But again, work. easy to assemble right uh -huh. beforehand. Totally. Mm -hmm. And if you don't make cranberries, you can buy cranberries in the jar, but you want to get the chunky cranberries, yes. not the jelly, which yes. is my and, was my dad's favorite. Well, mm -hmm. and you, oh, sorry. Go just ahead. Saying, go ahead. No, 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 no. I was just going to say the nice thing about <laughs> all of these is that they're small. Like you're, especially if you're having a big meal, yeah. you don't want, you want people to eat the the, the meal yeah. you don't want them to fill up on appetizers yeah. these are little just a couple just things a little something. and you're done yeah, and they're fast and furious yeah well, I, i'm sorry but i did forget the crackers obviously you gotta have something to put this on <laughs> not that even hey, <laughs> you were doubling a lot of times the baguettes that i used come mm -hmm. in a two you could toast some of those and use those well, that and, 
And then it's all the same. It, everything's good. And if you don't want the cream cheese, you could use the goat cheese. For me, the cream cheese is a little easier for everybody. Some it is. Don't like it is. Lots of people yeah, don't like goat cheese. cheese. And true. same thing with the cocktails. I'm sure there's a way to maybe make those not so strong, make them mm -hmm. a little weaker. Absolutely. Yeah. You no. make it to fit you and your family and yeah, friends. Yes. Their yeah. taste, right? Yeah. It's perfect. Okay, yeah. so happy yeah. holidays. Happy holidays, all. See you next year. Yeah, yeah.